Today we're going to be talking about the FlexBRA system integrating into the GSI AudioStar Pro. Now in order for the FlexBRA to integrate with the AudioStar Pro, we need three things. One being the actual AudioStar Pro itself. You need a FlexBRA system installed as it normally would be with the IR sensor somewhere outside the booth. And then finally you'll need this auxiliary cable provided by FlexBRA in order for the AudioStar to communicate with the system. Once we have all those, installation is fairly simple. So we will turn the unit around to the back and on one end of the flex cable is a dual connector consisting of a USB cable and an eighth inch jack input. The USB cable simply provides the cable power uh, and that can be plugged in really to any USB but because the AudioStar has so many ports, you can pick the USB port you prefer. Um, I like the one on the back just because it's out of sight and you can't see it. Uh, the other input is for the actual VRA connection on the back of the AudioStar, which you can plug in as pictured here. And that's all that we plug into the actual AudioStar itself. Now we can take the other end of the cable, which comes with a magnetic rubber foot or adhesive Velcro. And this should secure onto a booth wall near where your current IR sensor is. Um, it, doesn't have to be right next to it. It can be maybe below your desk, but it is important that it is in line of sight of those IR sensors so that the IR emitted from that cable can be picked up by the receiver. So with everything installed, we want to test to make sure that our positioning is good for the IR sensors. And the way we can really know if we have a good position is how responsive it is to rapid movement. So we'll do those here real quick. And that would be a good installation of the Flex VRA integration cable to the GSI AudioStar Pro. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out and we look forward to serving you.